No matter where you are on your financial journey, you need to know that it's possible for anyone to turn their financial life around and start saving money. Sometimes all it takes is that first step in the right direction to get things moving in your favor. But, as with most things, sometimes that very first step is the hardest part. None of these tactics will be life-changing on their own, but they can make quite a difference over time if you're able to implement more than one. Some of these suggestions take just a few minutes, while others require a bit of regular effort. Still, they're all incredibly simple, anyone can do them. Obviously, not all of these tips will apply to everyone. When you do, you may quickly find that you're saving more money than you ever thought possible. Say goodbye to debt. Monthly debt payments are the biggest obstacle to saving money. Debt robs you of your income. So it's about time you get rid of that debt. The fastest way to pay off debt is with the debt snowball method. This is where you pay off your debts in order from smallest to largest. Sounds kind of intense, right? Don't worry, it's more about behavior change than numbers. Once your income is freed up, you can finally use it to make progress toward your savings goals. By Generic In most cases, the only thing that's better about brand name products is the marketing. I mean, look at that box. Generic brands of medicine, staple food items, cleaning supplies and paper products cost far less than their brand name, marked up friends, and they work just as well. Save money automatically. Did you know that you can save money without thinking about it? Yup, you can set up your bank account to automatically transfer funds from your checking account into a savings account every month. If that sounds scary to you, you can also set up your direct deposit to automatically transfer 10% of each paycheck into your savings account. Pretty nice, right? Turn off the television. One big way to save money is to drastically cut down on the amount of television you watch. There are a lot of financial benefits to this, less exposure to spending inducing ads, a lower electric bill more time to focus on other things in life and so on. Master the 30-day rule. Avoiding instant gratification is one of the most important rules of personal finance, and waiting 30 days to decide on a purchase is an excellent way to implement that rule. Quite often, after a month has passed, you'll find that the urge to buy has passed as well, and you'll have saved yourself some money simply by waiting. If you're on the fence about a purchase anyway, waiting a while can give you a better perspective on whether it's truly worth the money. Write a list before you go shopping, and stick to it. One of the easiest ways to save money, is to only shop when you have a list. Because when you're without one, you typically end up making impulse buys and unplanned purchases, all things that cost money. Creating a list before you go to the grocery store, is especially important. Not only can it help you buy items that fit with your meal plan, but it can also help you avoid buying food you might waste. Always create a list and more importantly stick to it. You can also take advantage of a cash back rewards card that gives bonus cash at grocery stores, just be sure to pay off the balance each month. Repair clothing instead of tossing it. Don't toss out a shirt because of a broken button, so on a new one with some closely matched thread. Don't toss out pants because of a hole in them, put in a patch of some sort and save them for times when you're working around the house. Most basic sewing jobs can be completed by anyone, and a little bit of practice goes a long way. Learning basic sewing skills is a great way to save some money, and extend the life of your clothing. Don't spend big money entertaining your children. Most children, especially young ones, can be entertained very cheaply. Buy them an end roll of newspaper from your local paper and let their creativity run wild. Play ball in the backyard. Head to the park. Plant a garden. Teach them to ride a bike without training wheels once and for all. 
Realize that what your children want most of all is your time, not your stuff, and you'll find money in your pocket and joy in your heart. For heaven's sake, quit smoking. If you're still a smoker, you have to know by now that your habit is not only expensive, but potentially deadly as well. If you want to add years to your life and save a boatload of money, the easiest thing to do is to stop smoking altogether. You can quit cold turkey, try some of the many anti-smoking products that are out there, or switch to an electronic cigarette to buy some time. Whichever path you choose, you will be much better off. Lower your cell phone bill. If your monthly cell phone bill competes with your monthly grocery budget, it's time to find ways to cut back. Save money on your cell service by getting rid of extras like costly data plans, phone insurance and unnecessary warranties. And don't be afraid to haggle with or completely switch your provider. It might require a little persistence and research, but the savings are worth it. You may not become rich overnight, but the key to amassing a huge savings is patience. Saving money comes down to becoming aware of your unconscious habits and making a consistent effort to change them. Anyone can be more financially responsible in a few simple steps, using the many resources available to them.